Navy's most famous little ships, HMS Grey Goose, has a new role. She has become a floating test bed for the most advanced marine gas turbines in the world today, the Rolls-Royce RM60. When Grey Goose, skippered in those days by Lieutenant Commander Peter Scott, battled with e-boats in World War II, she was powered by the Navy's lightest and most modern steam machinery. But fast and powerful as she was then, her new engines give her one-third more power for half the engine weight and three-quarters the engine space. Planing along at nearly 50 knots, that's over 55 miles an hour to landlubbers, she's still not flat out. Only the Navy and the backroom boys know her full performance and they aren't talking. You need pads on your ears to look after these engines, they scream like a jet fighter. Grey Goose handles beautifully with her new engines. The controls look like a BBC Studios. In the never-ending drive for more power and less weight, the Navy are well ahead.